Take a trip on the wild side. We're going to follow a jumbo rat as it passes along the lizard's throat and into the stomach. A doctor of veterinary medicine provided our channel with a wide variety of high quality endoscopic videos. We're happy to share them with you. The rat is squeezed along the lizard's esophagus by muscular contractions called peristalsis. As the rat makes its way to the stomach, its hind feet disappear. Goodbye, rat. Thanks for volunteering. Exotic animal endoscopy is scarce, especially reptile endoscopy. And we're happy to provide our viewers a rare opportunity to learn about the inside nuts and bolts of predatory reptiles. The rat is squeezed along the lizard's esophagus by muscular contractions called peristalsis. As the rat makes its way to the stomach, its hind feet disappear. When the esophagus forces the rat past the sphincter into the lizard's stomach, mucus, hydrochloric acid, and digestive juices that are present in the stomach act on the rat to digest it. Only the tip of the rodent's tail is seen as its body travels to the lizard's stomach for digestion. Muscles behind the rat squeeze together while muscles in front relax, allowing the rat to pass along the esophagus. This is a science-based channel that strives to educate people about reptile behavior, often feeding behavior. And we're often asked questions about behavior which we try to respond, especially students in academia. Any questions, let us know. Don't forget to subscribe so you can join us this season for another episode of Reptile Channel. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.